How's it feel to know that you broke the picker? Feels great. Feels great. Shot! Oh! I've had it! Doesn't look in focus. There it is. Hello, everybody. So this video is going to be visually stunning because in this box, I have something very special. We're going to take it out. And it is the new GoPro 11. So let's unbox it and see what we're, uh, this is what I'm dealing with <laughs> while, while I'm trying to do this. So I've had the GoPro 4, I've had the 6, two GoPro 8s, two GoPro 9s, and now the GoPro 11. And I'm filming on a Canon M50, which I believe is a mirrorless camera. So let's dig into it. There it is. Catch this. Thank you. Shit, yeah, there's a screen on it. <laughs> Breaks it before you even get it out. Yeah. All right, so there it is, folks. The GoPro 11. Ooh, take this. So, yeah, we're going to... Should we peel it off yet? I, it'd be very satisfying to... Check it out. Look at this, look at this. Okay guys, so the next footage you see will be with the GoPro 11. So please comment, tell me if you can tell a big difference uh, from the 11. We're also gonna shoot some with the GoPro 9. So let me know if I uh, was money well spent or if I kinda waste my money because you can't tell and most people are watching on their smartphones anyway. All right, so let's see what this GoPro 11 looks like. Here we are in the barn. How's it looking? Does it look? visually stunning are you thinking to yourself wow that is a crystal clear picture come out here in the sun a little bit beautiful day yet again not a cloud in the sky We've got the cotton picker there we've been working on it we'll be picking cotton here in about uh well today is friday so saturday sunday monday about four or five days we'll be picking cotton so before we know it we'll be rolling with that you got jeff in the background he's already picking uh peanuts Kyle's got the dump cart ready to roll. So let's head out there and see what those peanut pickers are looking like. Trevor got our flag hung up this morning. Oh, it's hot. The truck has been in the sun for a good four hours. So I'm shooting at 5.3K. So I'm really not sure what that means. I know 4K is great. That's better than 1080p, which is what I usually shoot in. So hopefully 5.3 will be even better. I got a new GoPro 11, I'm testing it out. That's a squeaky window. This is a good peanut or a bad peanut. Nothing in it. Nothing in it. Dad gum pops. All right, now we are on the hyper wide setting. Earlier I was on wide, then it's got super wide, and now it's hyper wide. So huge wide angle. I'm not a big fan of the massive wide angles, but uh, see what we think about this. here in the office and now I'm gonna put on the media mod which is uh 
I don't know why I'm wearing sunglasses indoors, but um, I've already got them. So this is my GoPro 9. You notice it's got the media mod. It's supposed to improve your audio quality and you can also run your uh, like wireless mics and all that. You can hook lights up to it, get the cool uh, microphones and all that. I'm gonna turn it off, put this on it, and then tell me if you can tell a difference from the audio. So. Okay, I got the media mod on. So, can you tell a difference from the audio? Probably not in here, indoors, but uh, I think outside it really limits your wind noise and uh, makes it sound a little bit better. Check it out, Keefe. GoPro 11. Blue, it's just like the rest of them. That's blue, see? Oh. That's about the only difference. <laughs> Shooting at 5.3K now. Uh, 5K. 5.3K. 5 5.3K. Gosh, I might have to get all these I may be wrong, but I don't I think there's very few TVs that actually can broadcast in 5.3. What do I know? Trevor, how does the GoPro 11 feel in your hand? It feels pretty good. It's nice, hey. slick design. It is very slick. Hey, can we turn the tractor off? Yeah. Yeah. I mean I can turn it off. What has happened is Keepy has broke the peanut picker. Peanuts aren't feeding there like he wants them. So we're trying to fine tune it. We've got a plate that's bent that Trevor broke. And we're gonna take it out. Wait, what? No? Don't let facts get in the way of a good story. <laughs> Keepy, you got a 9 16 that would fit a 3 8 drive? <sighs> Several of these. Got a half inch. Uh, yes, give me that and I'll just get my. Then I got. You got short ones and long ones. Which one? It don't Maybe this camera takes away 10 pounds. Mm. It makes me look darker. Darker? Yeah, tan. Tan? I hope it makes me look attractive and an athletic build. You look really athletic right now. Did you pay for the extended uh, warranty? No, but I am a GoPro uh, subscriber. It's probably tur Is that turning the top one? All right, so we got this little finger, I guess you would call it. It's bent and it keeps getting bent. So we're just gonna take it out. Bam. Awesome. All righty. Back up a little bit. That GoPro. Yeah, hang on to it. We might be able to fix them. I don't know where the other one's at. It came out. I was chunking in this wagon and add some weight to it. No, no camera. No. Not while I'm drinking my blue raspberry. What is it, a blue made. raspberry? Yeah, no, they say all that, like, the dye is terrible for you. Like red 40, the blue, all that stuff. I'm here for a good time, not a long time. <laughs> Okay guys, we are uh, now headed back to the peanut field. Still got an issue with Keefe's picker. It's just not wanting to feed the peanuts into the picker. Said it's just getting there and just wadding up and wadding up and wadding up. So cross your fingers, we're gonna uh, see what she does. Man, that is a good looking GoPro. 11. I know, the, the screen on the back looks beautiful. Doesn't it? Trevor's gonna be filming with the uh, GoPro 9. Ooh. Are you recording? I'm recording. All right, I'm you're recording, recording me, you. Recording me. But you're recording in 1080p. I think that's what you call it, 1080p. Yeah. Whereas I'm filming in 5.3k. That, that is that's a big difference. Superb quality. Midland for hooking us up this year with some CBs. What you thinking? She still looks she's widening up a little bit in the middle. Ah, shucks. Now, something I did notice 
on these pieces where that auger mm -hmm. comes through oh a lot of them are getting rounded on the side see how round that one is right i wonder if that could have something to do why that's getting uh could be the auger hitting it well the auger did catch this yeah Well, my GoPro died. That's not a, not a good sign, but I do have what's called the Enduro battery, which comes with the GoPro 11. It's supposed to last a lot longer than your conventional GoPro batteries, which is what I had in it to begin with. So we'll see how long this new battery lasts. We got the plate, got it straightened up. We're about to put it back in the picker, cross our fingers, and uh, ho hopefully that it works. You said you found a problem. I think so. What is it? It's all built right here. I think that plate on the bottom that we were talking about the other day. Yeah. Ow. Good gracious. Pound of half of grass hung in that. Oh, that auger's hot. Take it right here in the middle. Got all this grass right here. Oh, hell, that's what it is, man. Yeah. Where it's wore out and it's catching. Where it split. That's this whole cool. thing split right here. Yeah, it's split and full of Hey, stuff in it. That's why it won't feed because it's clogged up right here. I'm going to let it slide. That dirt my teeth. My uh, you don't look as bad as I thought you would look. Hmm. Dang, you're bleeding though. Oh, Sorry, guy. Right there. Shit. All right, guys. Well, I didn't film any of this because mainly I didn't want my GoPro 11 to get messed up. So I'm filming on the GoPro 9 now. But we found the problem. We've got the, uh, the whole, I guess, trough you would call it, has broken apart and has kind of risen, risen up. So the peanuts are hitting that and just bending it and bending it and watering it. And that's why uh, the peanuts aren't feeding in. So we got in there, got it somewhat cleaned out. But I'm not sure how well, it's a very tight spot. But that is not supposed to look like that. All this is, that gap should not be there that shouldn't be there ah. just in time just in time going up here smoking cigarettes drinking dot mountain dews that's right living the life hey, that wasn't the one time we got somebody to extra to run a picker uh -huh. so i can go to a, a fire if i knew what it was i wouldn't have left what was it somebody burning yard trash mm -hmm. and it got away from them they didn't burn the house they ain't got a porch no more i mean they stopped you know it got stopped before it got to the house but they was talking about it was a structure flame showing and a brand new camera trevor How's it feel to know that you broke the picker? Feels great. Feels great. God, it's it's fragile. It's like a newborn baby. Got to break her in. Take three. That's got a big a gap. Too big a gap, Jimbo. The sun is going down and we're still working on the peanut picker headed up here now got the uh, irrigation gonna walk it out of uh, Jeff's way so we can pick up under it and get it out of the way looks like Kyle has got one semi trailer loaded good job man that's pretty and we got us another empty then we've got that wagon that we're uh, gonna load as well for a top secret uh, sample top secret test we'll call it and I just realized this whole time all day today I haven't had my uh, stabilization boost on so I wonder if it's more stable <sighs> late lee spot jumping on us pretty good time to get him out of the ground Oof. 
see, likes just a little bit. He can hit this one, then he can hop over here, hit these six rows. We'll have this out of the way, walk it back a little bit, and then we'll be able to water this side. We're gonna water it tonight. Um, so in two days, she'll be ready to plow. I'm gonna put a half an inch, and then she should be ready to uh, turn upside down. irrigation we can make it rain because it hasn't rained in probably four five weeks okay i got my shovel got our wagon here but i'm going to level it out this is our uh, top secret test wagon so don't want to spill a whole lot of peanuts headed to the peanut mill and everybody sees your peanuts out of the road and say hey you spilled some peanuts All right, here comes Kyle. Let's test his skills. It's pretty tricky dumping on a wagon with a uh, nut buggy. Or I feel that it is. Wait a bit. Almost buried my new GoPro. everybody well we got this wagon loaded what a day poor keefe didn't get to pick peanuts but about uh about one through he stayed broken down all day but uh we did get it fixed so we're gonna finish these peanuts tomorrow won't be able to quite knock them out uh today because it's gonna be dark here in just a minute and we got that little bit behind me and then we got some in rows over here to pick so anyways thanks so much for watching this video please comment could you tell a difference in the footage i want to know shot this whole video in 5k is the gopro 11 is it all that it's cracked up to be is the gopro 9 just as good so be cool to, to uh get your guys feedback on it but anyways thanks for watching until the end jesus loves you guys keep it in the field rows see ya bye Far, focus .com.